Donnie Norm over here, and we've got part of our family over here, one of the greatest bass players on the planet, and uh, my friend Cody Wright. And uh, I was on a Joe Bonamassa blues cruise, and Cody was playing with Eric Gales. And uh, when I heard him play, I actually had to wait around at the end of the set because I grew up with Jocko Pastorius, and he kind of reminded me so much of Jocko. Uh, even, you know, he would wear sometimes a hat that was kind of like Jocko's. Now he's got his hair slicked back. <laughs> if he dyes his hair gray, I'm going to want <laughs> money for you copying my look. <laughs> so I'm not going to, you know, stand for that unless I get something for it. <laughs> this guy can play his butt off. And uh, so, and you're playing with a real good friend of mine, Chris Kane, yeah. who is one of my favorite blues players ever. And Chris is one of the most talented guys, great guitar player, great singer. A lot of people don't know he's a great keyboard player and a horn player too. Absolutely, he brings he brings it all to the stage. The multi-talented, legit, beautiful He guy. is, absolutely. Just one of the best players you'd ever want to hear. And uh, I really love his music. And you guys were in Europe and you were touring and everywhere? Yeah, we did a couple weeks in Europe, you know. Um, Belgium, the Netherlands, Germany about two weeks of that and uh, it's just a blast to hear the music the chemistry just like when you talk to someone more often the musical chemistry the more you play with someone more often develops like a conversation right you know you have ways of, of of responding to what the person is, is putting down and we develop that over time. And he's such a good overall musician. He's super tasteful and, uh, you know, I guess you're playing a lot more traditional blues than you would with maybe Eric or that kind of thing. But, um, and again, Eric plays great blues as well. But, you know, it's a little bit different. Eric might be a little more modern, but, uh, you know, Chris is just uh, terrific. Terrific player all, all the way around. And what a crazy character, too. You know. <laughs> yeah, a huge lesson in dynamics, a huge lesson in just making every sound that comes out of the guitar just groove and be a part of the show and be a part of what's happening. You know, if you pull your string off a little bit or anything like that, just make that, you can do that in a tasteful way, I've found from Chris, you know. Right, it's so. real musical all the way around. Yeah, so, absolutely. Cody, um, uh, you know, we're going to get Cody to play a little bit for you because Cody is just, he blew my mind the first time I heard him. And I tell you, every time he took a solo with um, uh, Eric Gale's band, and um, you know he brought the house down, you know, so um, it just it was something else. So play a little bit for us. You got your looper and all that. So yeah, uh, yeah, I got all kinds of stuff here. Alrighty, thank you so much, Norm. It's uh, great to buddy. be back and great to see you. You too. It's beautiful.
guy is something else, and he's got these looper happening, and talk about playing with yourself. I mean, I'm talking about music, <laughs> guy, but, uh, but he, he's really something else. He is a whole band all in once. He's a great guitar player, by the way, as well. Oh, thanks, Dave. And uh, so it's always uh, a good thing having Cody in here, and uh, hopefully we're going to get you. You're living around here right now. Right? Yeah, I'm pretty close by now. So. All right, we're going to put you to work and give you some more uh, time to do some more videos for our people because everybody loves you and the great Cody Wright right yeah. here at Norm's Rare Guitars. And when Chris Kane is playing, you go see Chris Kane, you're going to see a great show. <laughs> it's so fun to be a part of that. So. All righty. Cody Wright. Thank you. <laughs>